internet. You are joining me in the car on my way to work today because I need to post a video sometime soon. It's been a little bit longer than I'd like since I posted a video, but that's because the stuff that I filmed is gonna take a little bit longer to edit. I decided what better way to do this than a car vlog. But I didn't really come up with an idea of something to talk about today. So we're gonna do a stream of consciousness and see how that works. I'm a little concerned about a stream of consciousness vlog because I end up cutting quite a bit of stuff out when I edit because it's like random tangents that I don't need to go on. And I am curious how I'm gonna edit something that is just an entire video of random tangents. Oh my God, this is taking so long. There's so many people. Why are there so many people? So I'm still really intrigued by the idea of online friends because lately I've been making a new group of friends online through the Minecraft server that I've been playing on. They're part of the same community, like the same parent community, but it's like a different group. And I mean, the, there's overlap obviously, but it, it's just more people to be friends with and it's just such an interesting process to me. Sometimes it's really easy to make friends and I found for a lot of the people that I've made friends with on YouTube, it's been incredibly easy. But then there's other people that I wanna make friends with online and I just feel like there are some people where I almost need to explicitly say I have the interest in becoming actual friends with you and chatting with you and that's just awkward. I have problem building relationships that don't get built in an organic way. It's the same way with romantic relationships. It feels weird to me to have that conversation where it's like, what are we? Are we boyfriend, girlfriend, or are we dating? It's always been a weird thing to me. So it's the same way with friendships. I feel like it's hard to have to explicitly state your intention to be friends and to say like, I want to spend more time getting to know you and talking to you. I don't know, it's weird, it's weird. <sighs> friends just become friends, how does that work? I also continue to have dreams about people that I don't know very well in real life. Last night I had a really little tiny dream about someone that I've only met in person once, but it's part of the YouTube channel that I watch a lot. And that always freaks me out. It freaks me out my, that my brain can build a person enough that they seem convincing. The other part of doing this stream of consciousness video today was that I I am feeling weird and stressed this week. Partly my own fault because I haven't been staying on top of my classwork and I've been sick. I was dealing with migraines and allergies and a bunch of things and I just, my brain was not working. Like, <laughs> if you had any sort of interaction with me over those two days, you would realize something was not all, all cylinders were not firing. So I've been trying to recover from that and as a result, I have been stressed and I don't know, today I just woke up feeling panicky and like unsatisfied and I don't know, very frustrated. I really wanted to talk, but I didn't really know what, how to do that. To go back to a conversation that I had last time we did a car vlog with the privacy thing. It's interesting because I have these kind of like things that I'm trying to deal with and a lot of times I just want to put them out on the internet and be like, hey everybody, this is a thing that I'm having a problem with. I would be perfectly comfortable with all of the internet strangers knowing about it. The problem is I have to be careful in the position that I'm in, especially now that I'm in a school. I'm currently working as a student teacher. I haven't really talked about that. That'll come in a video later. So I do have to be a little bit careful about what I share. And it's also hard because you don't want to come off as complaining or whining or just negative. I made a few tweets this morning that were super negative because I was in a bad mood and I almost felt like I needed to tweet again and be like, I'm so sorry for all of this negativity because I, I don't want that. I hope that I come across as a relatively positive person. I try really hard to be. So I apologize if I was real negative this morning. That was not the greatest thing. The other thing that I've been thinking a lot about lately and I've been thinking about whether or not I wanted to do a video on it because it kind of seems like it's a little bit defeating the purpose if I make a video out of it, but I am constantly worried about being selfish. Like I think by nature, the way that I live my life right now and kind of the goals that I have and the circumstances in which I live, there's not really like another option. I'm only responsible for myself and for the most part, like I'm the person that I deal with on a day-to-day -day basis. <sighs> I don't know. 
how do I say this and not come across so terribly? I don't have other people that are relying on me that, or that are dependent on me. And I don't have a lot of people that I say, see on a day-to-day -day basis. So a lot of my interaction with other people is just chatting with people on the internet. Right now, I don't do a lot with other people and I feel really self-conscious about that. I like I feel like I'm just waiting for someone to call me out and be like, hey, why is everything that you talk about and do about you? Like why don't you care about other people? I don't know what to do about it. I don't know. Alright, so I am basically at work. This has been the weirdest thing. I don't know if I'm gonna try this out again. Let me know what you think of stream of consciousness videos. Is this a format that you think is interesting or too rambly? And feel free to comment about any of the various things that I talked about. I don't know why I'm telling you that you should feel free to comment about things because like obviously it's YouTube. You can comment about whatever you want. If you want, you can comment about pickles. I don't care. I mean, I do care, like I wanna to talk to you guys about cool things because you guys are really smart, but if you wanna talk about pickles, comment about pickles. I guess that's the moral of this video that had no moral, okay. <laughs> Hopefully I'll see you guys back here later with a more structured video. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you all later.